as he long trajectory drop punt, but that's too much time. Well done, Justin Matt. A great year last year. Gives it out to Ashman. He's been in superlative form. Back it comes to Shine. Shine with a little chip pass towards Justin Matt, who marks 35 metres out from goal directly in front. But it's far too late for the Blues. Four form of this game. Well in hand at the 27 and a half minute mark of this final quarter. Justin Matt right over this football as he stabs at that one, a very, very high ball. The goal up by hardly moved at all, and it's a goal to the Blues. He's looking for options, but they're not coming. There's Madden, has he drift? Well done, Justin Madden. Well done, Craig Bradley. And Craig Stewart, you cannot afford to go to sleep and let a player do what he just did. Well, he left Michael Roberts, uh, one out with Justin Madden, Don, and that's... Uh, well, that's just not balance. on. You just can't afford to do that because Madden is a good mark. He hasn't taken too many today. Lines up. The Carlton 16th, his first. And he makes no mistake. Bruce looking for Rendell. And Madden over the top of him again, starring in the ruck for a throw in. Now, Roger Merritt uh, versus Justin Madden. And Madden, oh, lovely palm. Finds Merritt beautifully. You know, a bit of in interference. Now he is. It's the hand pass out, taken by Dennis Carroll. Carroll's kick up towards uh, Madden at the back. Has he got that one? He has. Justin showing a little bit of aggro. Give me the hand pass. He's got Ian Roberts well downfield. The back pocket player. Will he score at the back is Madden? Madden takes the mark. Right next to the behind post. 32 the Sydney Swans to count for four goals, 327. Matt with a great mark in front of uh, Heidmarker. Quickly plays on a short pass, it'll be okay. And Bradley looking good for now to Bays. Bays is clear, a left foot kick up there towards the full forward position. But there's the big fella doing a great job, Justin. Matt takes a mark in the fence down there on the back bucket. Ball back out towards Dorothy and Danaher. Run up, Madden is just about underneath the football, but he still wins it. Down to Bradley. Across to Robertson, Carlton forward again, and uh, here he is, man of the moment, Steve Kerr. Collingwood wanting quick goals. Madden wins it off beautifully. McKenzie to harms to the plur. He gets it up to big Madden lurking in the goal square. Up he goes, and down he comes with the football. So 20 metres out from goal, the big fellow. Those long arms, he must be about 10 foot tall when he puts those arms up. Justin Madden. Lining it up like a plum bob. He's had eight kicks. Putting it on its way, and he's put it through. So Carlton, through Madden, get their 11th goal. Out wide to Turner hand. Turner hand to Alvin. Alvin hooks it back. Justin Madden and Payne Madden. Too big, too tall, too good. He's 15 metres out, 45 degree angle. He's taken four marks and nine kicks to Madden. Nine kicks and four marks and many, many hit outs. I know you're saying about Brucey Dill not having much to beat, but the way he's going about his job down there, Pete, he's doing a great job for Carlson. Go back to Madden now, taking this shot at goal. The siren sounds, it's half time, so Madden will take the shot after the siren. He puts it on its way, the umpire to the applause of the crowd, in the kick, in comes Madden to take the mark, the big fellow, I think he's been paid. Yes, as I said before, even though the score's a mile apart, the action is still here. On seven's big league, look at it, a bit of action around. A lot of frustration out there for some of the Melbourne players. In fact, all the Melbourne players, I might suggest. Well, this will be interesting. He could take him right back to the centre of the goal square. He has, oh, yes, boy, he well, has. He can't miss now, can he? Although he is a left footer, I've seen him. Percy Jones, but Percy Jones was having a shot from here. He, he might kick the post or something like that. Oh, I don't but, pick uh, on Percy. Oh, Pete. What's he going to do? Is he going to kick a banana, kick it? He's, oh, he's making him go round on the line. This is very, very interesting, this. He can't take him back any... Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh I've seen everything I, now. I call that cheating. I call that cheating. Anyhow, at the MCG on Sevens Big League, he's kicked his third goal, Madden. No, you, you won't see a better one than that. I think uh, Kernahan will be the P if the kick drops short. The ball will drop short. Madden's Big there. Madden's there too, and he's got it. <laughs> he's got it, the big fellow. Only 15 metres out from goal. He will be the thorn in North Melbourne's side this afternoon, unless they can chop him off at the knees or something like that.
but 15 metres out. Madden should not, will not miss this. He's just too tall. When he puts those arms up, he's a very, very tall boy. The plumb bob situation, he lines it up, getting himself, he uses that as a plumb bob, then he lines it up like That's his brother. That's your profession Simon. coming out now, Jack. Oh, that it is, that it is. <laughs> you watch this one go through. And away it goes into the Robert Heatley stand, it travels. See from the 50 metre line with the torp, no, he's going to drop punt. I thought he would have gone the torp. Up towards Roach who flies, and they must pay the man in front. A very, very strong mark there by Justin Madden. His job, is no, he? he's getting a few kicks, but he's, uh, at this stage he's being beaten by Conlon. Taken by Ashman, the kick very high. Well, a brilliant play when he's flying high. Up it goes there towards Sagan, but he's outnumbered there. Coming at the back that time was Madden to take a strong mark. Not a big guy, as I said. Troy's cause percentage-wise. Say that again as we see uh, fellows on the right foot. Here's Madden. Oh, gutsy mark. And Motley, oh, he might have got in the Motley a bit there, but there's Madden running off like a rover. Justin Madden kicked.